Hello everyone and welcome to Resident Evil Remake Part 2 or 3 or 4 or 3, I think it's 3, Part 3. Part 3 is what we're playing at the moment. And I have no idea what we're doing. We're exploring using this key, I believe. Uh, we need to go and... Get, we'll get the map, we'll get the map, which is what the wooden mount is used for. We'll swap the emblems out because we have the right key. And we're pretty much good to go. Why am I holding my side? I'm in low caution. This could be deadly. If I get bitten, a zombie does have a chance to one-hit me from this state. To insta-death, which is not good. Insta-death is bad. Death is bad. Insta? Mm, you depends. He twitched. He definitely twitched. Okay, where am I going? Let's work out where I'm going. Alright, I need to go down here. There is a stupid zombie here, which I should be able to just run past. Good. Everything is going well so far. I've used the armor key. That is good news. I've turned the lights off, by the way. It's getting dark. It's rainy. And it's tense. Tense, bruh. It's not that tense. It's tense. Okay, we're going to get another stun walker. That noise. Let me turn the volume up. Still quiet. Let's turn it up some more. It won't be turning up for you. You're always at 100. There we go. You're always at 100% volume. But I've got mine on maybe like 40% at the moment. This room is a very small room. I think. Yeah, man. Oof, well, there was a zombie in here for some reason. Right, there is an inscription here. A tiger glowing with blue and yellow light. You will find two gems later on. One is blue and one is yellow. I believe you can find a red one. I, I'm not sure. I am not sure. Do I want to go in here? That is the question. Literally glued to the screen about 10 seconds. 10 seconds? What? That may be not about 10 millimeters away from the screen. It's super wicked. I'd love to play this with like full face camera or something. Okay. This is not good news. There is one zombie on the floor there. The shelf is full of high proof liqueur. Liquor. Not liqueur. Liqueur is something completely different. I should have brought the shotgun. The door is stuck in something. I won't budge. Oh shit. I don't wanna do this. I don't wanna do this. Um I really don't wanna do this. Maybe we should heal up first. Okay. We're gonna have to use some bullets here. Clothes and various bits of junk are scattered everywhere. Don't wanna do this. Don't wanna do this. Don't wanna do this. Keeper's diary. May 9th, nineteen ninety eight. Played poker tonight with Scott and Alias from Security and Steve from Research. Steve was a big winner, but I think he was cheating. Scumbag. May 10th, two days later. One of the higher ups assigned me to take care of a new creature. It looks like a skinned gorilla. Charming. Feeding instructions were to give it animals. When I threw in a pig, the creature seemed to play with it, tearing off its pig's legs and throwing out the guts before actually eating it. Hmm. I want to be friends with these creatures. May 11th, the next day. Around 5am, Scott woke me up. Scared the sheet out of me too. Apparently, I go Italian. When I swear. Um, he, <laughs> he was wearing a protective suit. He handed me another one and told me to put it on. Said there'd been an accident in the basement lab. I just knew something like this would happen. Those bastards in research never sleep. Even on a holiday. I've been wearing the damn spacesuit since yesterday. My skin's getting grimy and feels itchy all over. The goddamn dogs have been looking at me funny. So I decided not to feed them today. Screw them. Went to the infirmary because my back is all swollen and feels itchy. They put a big bandage on it and told me I didn't need to wear the suit anymore. All I want to do is sleep. Found another big blister on my foot this morning. I ended up dragging my foot all the way to the dog's pen. They were quiet all day, which is weird. Then I realised some of them had escaped. <laughs> you noob. Maybe this is their way of getting back at me for not feeding them the last three days. If anybody finds out, they have my head handed to me. 
Rumours going around that a researcher who tried to escape the estate last night was shot. My entire body feels hot and itchy and I'm sweating all the time. I scratched the swelling on my arm and a piece of rotten flesh just dropped off. What the hell is happening to me? Fever gone but itchy. The day hungry and eat doggy food. Itchy, itchy. Scott came ugly face so killed him. Tasty. Itchy. Tasty. So that was the keeper's diary. The keeper of the dogs. I don't want to move because I know exactly what happens. <laughs> Run. He is really tall. Actually, let's kill him. Get off, you noob. Wow, he died in like two shots. Stay down. Get off. How is he not... Oh, nice one. Critical hit. Another stun walker. Was that really worth it? That other one's going to get... You'll come back as a crimson head zombie now. See, one bite down to caution. Lots of pills there. Hmm. I might make a point of coming back and burning that zombie. I need to go get the lighter anyway because I need the lighter to light the fire Ugh, to get the map. It's it's complex, okay? It's extremely complex. <sighs> that wasn't really worth it for a, a stun thing. I used a stun thing to get the stun thing. But at least we got a little bit of background on the keeper. So we'll start out with an accident in the basement. Oh hey. Nub. See, when we come back out, watch the guy on the floor. I'll remind you to watch him, but just watch him. He does twitch whenever you go past him. It's kind of creepy. A little bit creepy. It's extremely creepy. Okay, um, get the fuel canteen and take the lighter. Uh, okay, good. We'll go back and burn that zombie because I don't trust him. They can open doors now. They can just break through the doors. Which you saw last episode? Episode before? Yeah, last episode. Episode. See? Twitch. I forgot to remind you, but Twitch. It looks like this one's been dead for several hours, which means it's getting back up soon. Come on. This is not a good place to, <laughs> to lure him, but hey. Oh, what the hell? Get off, noob. Low caution again now. Oh, great, exactly where we started. Not going well. <sighs> I think I'm too eager to conserve ammunition. But because there hardly is any ammunition, I kind of need to do it. I don't have a choice, okay? See? Still there. Not quite transformed yet, but he's getting that way. And step back. Now he will not be coming back, which is good news for everyone. Just trying to think, I'm going right here, and this will take us back to the hallway where we first started, where we first found the first zombie. Where Kenneth is. Um, the zombie is there, I'm thinking of taking him down too. Because the hallway is so narrow that you can't really get round him. And I don't really have faith in my luring abilities anymore. Let's see if I can get that headshot. Wait for him to get back up. 
can't get a headshot if he's on the floor. I don't think I managed to get the headshot. No. Oh well, I have to burn him instead. Cool guys don't look at explosions. So we need to come in here to uh, use the shield thingy. What do you call it? Emblem. I would so get a drink. If you're in this kind of situation, you would you would have a drink or two, wouldn't you? Just to soothe the nerves. What is this? Musical score. Not blood for once. Luckily, Joe can play the piano. It's not necessary to use this now. Are you serious? It's always necessary to do this. Section of the music is mi oh okay. We gotta go find it as well. One lad sonat sonata. I didn't realise half it was missing as Jill as well. Fun times. I don't know where the other half is. I'm trying to think where I need to go. Let's go to the second floor on the opposite side where the the library room was where I got the lighter. Slow motion. Yeah, this is the right way. Guess how I'm going crazy. Oh. Can't remember how many zombies there are down here. Not going in there yet. Something's trying to get through somewhere though. He did, whoa! Do we see these moves? <laughs> Hopefully that means there won't one out here as well. There is, I'm pretty buggered. Nah, that was the one that was standing there. So he was like, hey, I'm getting bored of this place, let's let's carry on. I'm gonna pop to the save room quickly. Oh, there's a note there. Oh, straight into him. That's it, I'm killing this guy. Is he dead? Yeah, I'll come out and burn him in a minute. I left some bullets in the room to the right. Feel free to use them if you manage to get yourself in trouble. Barry. Oh, Barry. Barry's so good to us. <laughs> what did he actually leave us, I wonder? Did you leave us, Barry? Left us grenade rounds and a first aid spray. I could have done with some ammo. I've got to go out and uh, burn this body quickly. I have to use the kerosene. Fuel canteen. Still got four daggers. I don't really want to use them up. Okay, leave the musical score there. I'm going to leave this here as well for the moment. We are going to keep this on us, keep the lighter on us, keep the fuel canteen on us, maybe? I'm going to try not to kill anymore. We haven't got any healing items either. Uh, we need to pick up that first aid spray. That is the only healing item I've got left. This is not good. And I'm nearly dead as it is. Freaking difficult, man. Oh, 
Half of the missing, the mu <laughs> half the music's missing as well. This is not the proper save theme. I'm going to play around with the audio settings on the emulator and see if I can get it working. Because that'd be nice. Ah, it's good. It's gone. Thank God. All right, let's adventure. Adventure awaits. Come on. But you're so needy. Oh, for God's sake. My phone is ringing too. Ugh. I've got to take this guy down. Sorry, phone, you're going to have to wait. Shh. I'm trying to kill things. Reload. Oh, I must be like danger. I need to use this first aid spray. I just only just got it, but I need it. Oh man. <sighs> I'm actually genuinely a bit worried about our success rates at the moment. Oh, um, I've never been so happy to see you. Come here, ma wa ma wa ma wa. Ma wa. Okay, first you light the fire, which makes it a lot more comforting, and then you, you use this wooden board, which somehow gives you a map. I just, uh, I don't understand that. It's locked. Carving of a helmet. God, I better get my ideas together. Maybe I'll, I'm gonna actually have to start killing things. Use the armor key again. Oh, getting twitchy, getting worried, getting worried, man. Oh, red herb. That pretty much provides us with a first aid spring. Okay. You're unlocked using the lockpick. See, I don't know this game that well, so I don't know what to expect. As far as enemies, like, how much damage they're going to do, how much damage I'm going to do to them. Oh, Barry! Bro! <laughs> Barry, I didn't mean to get you that excited. Well, all right, steady on, Jill. Researchers will, huh? A letter is slipped inside. The top part of the letter is torn off and the rest is legible. This is good. Alma, I have tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts delayed the inevitable. I am infected. There is no cure for what will follow. Except when my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from them. My love for you. A oh, cringe. In an hour I have entered my eternal sleep where there is peace. Please understand. Please know that I am sorry. Martin Crackhorn. What do you make of it? Well, I guess we were right about this mansion being quite unnatural. Have a way with understatements. Where's the part that's torn off? Well, my only guess is that it was the most important part and somebody didn't want anyone to see it. Let's continue our investigation. Interesting. An unlocked case. It's full of various biological reports. Will you take the fish hook? Okay. The water tank smells like something once lived in there. Perhaps someone was using it to raise some kind of creature. Maybe. Will you take the lure of bee? Don't examine it. Nope. 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 They were mixed up. There you go. A crest. 
really. Jill, you big girl. It's not gonna hurt, is it? It's just a bit vicious. Strong old bee, though. Still got it. <laughs> a bee that took a shot. For a pistol, a point blank, and it's still like. It's buzzing around. Bloody things. Ooh. First take box. Oh, I remember this room, like, I always think there was someone under the covers. The footprints look like they're headed straight through the bed. Ink ribbons, don't need those. Looks like someone took something and then left in a hurry. Oh, another herb. Alright, I think we need to go back and save it. come back and torch that body actually the one near the top of the stairs before we finish this episode up it's gonna be nice and clear then this area will be safe for everyone Whew. it's tense man proper tense Keep that on us, put this back, put that, actually no, we need that. Put this hat back. I think this has got a first aid spray in it, this medical case. Yes, it's good. We're in a better shape now. We're not doing so bad. Let's get the kerosene. Burn that zombie. We'll get a first uh, ink ribbon out while we're at it. Top my kerosene up. I'll do it when I come back, actually. Where is the body? There it is. I'm always worried they're already crimson heads. You can usually tell by his feet. Nice one. GG, zombie. GG. Alright, I'm in fine. I've got a few healing items. I've got enough ammo. Um, a lot of the zombies are out of the way. Not doing too bad. There's still three in that hallway, though, which is not good for anyone. Uh, what am I doing? I'm topping up my kerosene and saving it. Not a single drop of kerosene remains. I've only had one fill up. Oh god. There's even less kerosene. Whew. Okay. Oh man, I need to just chill. That's tense as all hell. Thanks for watching, if you're still here. If you've got this far, comment in the comments Russian potato. Just so I know that you've actually, uh, Actually got this far. Russian potato. Freeze lamp. You're under a vest. Richard! What happened? You're wounded! <laughs>